So what is the importance and relevance of teamwork? Why teamwork? In teamwork, we leverage a diverse set of competencies, skills and abilities. In a term, when a team works together, we complement one another and together we create and build positive synergy. Synergy inspires generation of ideas and triggers flow of creativity and innovation. It boosts higher morale as we are there for one another, encouraging one another, cheering one another, learning from one another and even challenging one another, bringing out the best in each one of us. In teamwork, we lead ourselves and we share leadership as we pursue shared goals. There's improved communication, healthy conflict and improved workplace efficiencies. All of these together help in building a harmonious and positive workplace environment. And that leads to an enhanced workplace uh, experience for each team player, higher job satisfaction, more happiness, fulfillment, and it saves tons of time, energy, costs and resources. The result is co-creation and pure magic. There is a famous Ratan Tata quote, if you want to walk fast, walk alone. But if you want to walk long, walk together. Now, why did he say that? No task gets accomplished by any single individual. We need people of different kinds coming along, blending beautifully, in sync with each other for the magic to happen. We need people of different kinds. People by nature bring various different kinds of strengths and it is the task of a leader to blend them, give them the right roles and responsibilities so that they all work in tandem, giving the best output. An example that I could think of in an organization where I was an account leader was many of the mid-management people were given very similar managerial responsibilities and it was not working very efficiently. The people individually did not enjoy what they were doing nor was the team output very effective. So, during the annual performance appraisal conversations, there was a one-on-one -on -one meeting held with each and every leader to discover what would give, make them give their very, very best. The following facts emerged, so following patterns emerged. There were some of the people who wanted to do more creative jobs, innovate. There were some people who were very comfortable with metrics but not comfortable with dealing with people as in reporting, management, etc. were not their forte but individually they were very strong in numbers. There was this other kind of people who were extremely good at people relationships be it within the team as well as uh, interfacing with external teams. But they were not comfortable with numbers and the state that prevailed th back then was that all of them were doing all the responsibilities and they were not excelling. So we went back and tried aligning the strength of every individual to the maximum extent possible with the role they were playing. This over a period of time resulted in the individual employees enjoying what they are doing. They became more comfortable, more expressive and more shining in their day-to-day -day jobs. And they were also able to give a very, very effective output.